the team exclusive and welcome back to some more FIFA 21 content. Today is not a pack opening. I know, surprise, surprise. I am as surprised as everybody else, but today I thought it'd be quite fun because I've done this with um, the Hector Bellerin objective challenge where we've completed basically all of them and just for the last few uh, we basically do the last few objectives and then um, and then complete the card uh, to kind of show off a bit of the grind and it's just a bit of fun really. So we've got... Um, what's his name? Matthias, um, Matthias Cunha, Cunha, Matthias Cunha. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it or not, but we're going with that. Uh, as you can see, I've obviously I've completed four out of five. Um, I, it's really interesting this challenge because obviously the, the card itself isn't you know overly incredible. It is what it is. It's pretty pretty average for an 84 rated card. Um, there's probably quite a few players like him, or if not better, um, that you could probably get. But he is free. He is free and he has got the chance of being upgraded in the future. If he uh, gets a few informs or if his team does quite well, he could go up to like an 85, 86, 87 possibly, you know. There, there's there's huge potential for this card to be upgraded, but the challenge itself was scoring outside of the box goal, obviously in, in all in the headliners challenge for friendly's mode. Um, score and assist with, score and assist using Brazilian players in two separate wins, which is very interesting. Uh, score, uh, assist the goal using a th through ball with um, players of minimum four star weak foot in three separate wins and obviously win four matches with the last one being score in 10 separate matches. Now it's interesting from EA because they do this quite a lot and they do the score in 10 separate matches so when you see oh you've only got to win four well actually no you've actually got to win um, uh, oh it's actually you don't know there's no win challenge in this one so it's scoring 10 separate matches using Bundes. Okay, so, but they still do score in 10 separate matches or whatever, so you have to actually play a, a maximum of 10 um, to complete it. Now, what I found really interesting, and maybe it was just me, but um, the outside the box goal wasn't registering. Um, I was doing outside the box finesse goals, and I don't know if that was what was causing it. Um, I ended up just scoring just an outside the box, just, you know, power shot. So, don't know, maybe that was me. Maybe that was... EA uh, registering it I don't know but either way we have completed four out of five and the last one we've got to do today is score with um, some Bundesliga players now I'll show you the squad we've got going on show you the squad um, but yeah, obviously besides that outside the box one um, it was actually quite simple to be honest it was just playing people didn't really want to quit which I can understand as a lot of the challenges require you to actually play the match but this is our team um, this is our team and now I've tried to just build players or build a team with players I like. So we've got Van der in goal because I don't really have any other goalkeeper. We've got um, Apara. We've got Marquinhos at centre back. Hector Bailin. Got Bailey. Bailly. Got Firmino. Milinkovic Savic, which I completed. And he is a bit of a beast. He is a bit of a beast. We've got uh, Felipe Anderson. Human Son at left back. Um, Fat Ronaldo up at top. And Nabbers as well. So we've got those Bundesliga theme I will be swapping Bailey up to striker um, just in place of Ronaldo to try and get those Bundesliga goals um, and that's pretty much it I've been using Sun at left back which is really interesting because I used to do it in FIFA 17 no idea why I can't remember why I did it but I always used to just play human Son at left back and he was he was amazing so yeah for whatever reason I did that and I really enjoy it so there we are obviously max chemistry Everybody gets maximum chemistry wherever you put them. So it doesn't really matter who you choose. So you've got a very nice team, to be fair. Very nice team. That um, Coleman, I really kind of do regret not doing. Um, he, I've seen him so much, and he's so good against me. So I really wish I did do him. But it's a good team, to be fair. Good team. Not bad. A lot of very uh, sweaty players. Adama. I mean, she's not very many sweaty players. I've got Adama and Coleman, really. All the rest is uh, pretty pretty standard so we'll see how we do maybe i don't regret doing that coman after that um but let's okay and he's quit uh, I, I also realized as well that i'm uh, actually being quite quite an idiot to be honest so i can just do that it's max chemistry it doesn't matter <laughs> it, it doesn't matter um so another stable point to show that i'm actually an idiot but uh, it is what it is same guy cool let's see if he's just gonna <laughs> quit again I what is that oh my god come on bye there we go let's go 
Come on, now you can quit. Do the celebration. Yes, let's go. Let's go. <sighs> that was a good goal to be fair. I mean, he wasn't trying. He's just going to quit. And I'll take it. If he does, come on. There we go. There we go. You do love to see it. I never want people to really quit, but this guy just seems to be on one, so I have no idea what's going on, but I'll take it. An easy, easy victory. Not that we need it, but we also got the Bundesliga goal, so I will take that every day of the week. Is it going to be the same guy? Third time in a row. Is it going to be... Oh, it's not. Yeah. <laughs> I do, I do, I do respect that. That's a, a very interesting team. You do love to see Robin in goal, and who is that? Manuel Neuer <laughs> up at striker. You, you love to see it. Ronaldo. No! Wait. Wait. No, wait. Yes! I have no idea how that worked out. Let's go, wait. We didn't do it. Oh, I'll do it. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, man. That was a mess. Is he just going to quit, this guy? Come on. It can't be, can't be having it that simple. I wonder if he's got on the bench. He's got Hazard, Suarez, Gravenberch, Dumfries, Van Bergen, Emery Chan, and Roberto Funa. Like, I do respect this guy for having a really weird, interesting team, just playing players way out of position. Obviously, he's changed his formation now, you can see, to make it a little bit, a little bit less weird, but he's still playing players that don't have any ability in those positions, which I just don't know. No idea. Well, I mean... You know, saving grace is that at least we completed the challenge, which I didn't think we would do so quickly. Um, and in quite in what fashion we did do it. it was it just our goal was just a mess, man? Just a huge, huge mess. But uh, we take it. We take it. These are the these are the kind of opponents you would come up against in friendlies. Um, so it is what it is. So what is that? Oh my god! You're actually a full-on wet flannel. How has he missed that? He's actually got there as well. That's crazy. Go on, Nabbers. Use that strength. He has none. Great job. Why? It's gone through. Is he offside? Hey, let's go. He actually scored a goal for once. That's crazy, man. It's crazy. I, I like the passing just wasn't going where I, where I wanted it to, but I'll take it. Milikovic Savic getting on the score sheet. Anytime today would be would be great. Ah, there we go. Scabby, scabby players. I swear down. What is that? He took forever, but he still got it somehow. Let's go. Nabbers getting on the score sheet again. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, he didn't let me do... Okay. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, my God. And here we are again. So, waiting another 30 fucking seconds for this guy to choose who wants to sub off this time. Oh, Sun, what are you doing? Okay, well, Sun may not have been the best left-back choice, if I'm being perfectly honest. But, who actually cares? Oh, go on, Marquinhos. Oh, look at that. Oh, that was terrible. Oh, my God. Wow. I don't like Van der Sar. He actually sucks. Like, legit just sucks. I've never seen someone, like, not be able to save so much shit in my entire life. Like, I genuinely believe that 79 rated inform goalkeeper from the MLS is actually better. Like, he just makes saves. And that seems really weird to say, but he just actually just saves the ball. Go on. What? Oh, that's a shame. Well, anyway, there we go. So, game over. We unfortunately did lose 5-3. Uh, um, again, not that it matters. It really doesn't matter. This game was a huge mess regardless. Like um, like this, this goal, as you can see. It's just... Well, I mean... Ugh. Fair play for, for Nabbers for getting that in. Look like that angle. He was facing away from goal. He just turned around, shot like... Just, he's just a bit of a beast. <laughs> but... Two for Nabbers, one for Milinkovic Savic. Um, yeah, again, not that it really mattered that we lost. It was just really interesting to see how this guy actually played. Um, like, 
I still don't understand his choice of team. Like, he had Manuel Nora up at striker, which then he put to goalkeeper for Haaland. Like, why? <laughs> why? There we go. It actually wasn't very difficult in the end. It was very easy. It's just, just a bit time consuming playing all those kind of games. You played like 10 to 15 games to get this card. So is it worth it? Maybe. But yeah, so it, it's just really a case of if he fits your team, like if you've got a Brazilian, five go a Brazilian vibe going on, then um, sure, why not? I guess. Why not? Or if you've got like a Bundesliga team that you need a cam or a centre mid or something like that, then don't see any reason why not, to be honest. I don't see any reason why not. And also, he is free. He's a free. You just have to spend time getting him. It's not very difficult now that uh, basically the whole world has gone back into lockdown, so you've got plenty of time. No excuses. I'm joking, of course. But uh, yeah, you do have to spend just a bit of time getting him. Um, and you've got like, what, from when I was recording this, 10 days, I think it was, or just under. So you've got you've got a fair, a fair whack of time. Uh, and I think that's very, very doable. Either way, there we are. Look at that card design as well. I've got to say, that card design is one of the nicest so far, of course. I think it will be topped when Team of the Year comes out. I'm really interested to see what um, what they've done with... I think we already know what the card design is, but it'll be interesting to see if it is what we think it is. Um, but yeah, very, very nice stuff. And in fairness, 4-star, four 4-star, four high-low, 6-foot tall. It's got 88 finishing. Good passing. Dribbling is exceptional. Physicals are not bad as well. So, like, maybe if he goes up to an 85, 86, he could be a very, very good, good-looking card, to be fair. Um, but, yeah, so there we are. Matthias Cunha has been completed. And last one today. All of those packs were complete garbage. Can this one be anything but? So, rare. Wow. Well, not that I really expected anything. Um, but... I didn't definitely didn't expect hey Pele let's go Cunha and there we are so he has been done I do hope as well EA do more of this in the future more of um uh challenges in like a max chemistry mode because this was so much fun just playing with players where I've just thrown my control on the floor but yeah hopefully they do more of this you know because it, like I say it was so much fun playing with players way out of position Again, it wasn't the greatest team. If anything, it was actually very trash and it was very difficult uh, playing with this team. Like, Marquinhos just wasn't very good, I found, at centre-back. For me, he wasn't. Maybe that's just because I'm a bit shit. Um, Sun wasn't the best choice, but who cares? At the end of the day, who actually cares? Besides that, I mean, it was actually all right, to be honest. Like, Ronaldo was pretty good. I say pretty good. He was average. It just, I don't know, just didn't really, just didn't feel that great for me. But besides that, it was fun. It was fun. And I hope they do more of this in the future. More of um, the whole max chemistry thing. Not so much maybe like um, what they've been doing. Like managerial master masterpiece. Which is fun. Building like, you know, a lower rated team. But uh, I think this was a more enjoyable, more enjoyable experience. Anyway, there we are. Matthias Cunha has been completed. If you're doing him, do let me know what you think. If you've already used him or uh, if you are doing him or not. Let me know in the comment section below. Regardless, that is today's video done. Hope you have enjoyed. Um, yeah, like, there's that. It was really good fun, I think. Really, really good fun. I really enjoyed it. Um, bit of a grind. Like I say, you know, that's all you're really spending doing this card. It's just your time. So it's a, it is a bit of a grind, but I think it is worth it. It's a live item. You know, you get it for free. And uh, it doesn't really take too much to uh, to do. And you can build any team you like. Any team you like. You can have Manuel Neuer up at strike if you really, if you really so desire. I uh, wouldn't recommend it, but you're more than welcome to do that. Either way, hope you have enjoyed. If you have, please do drop this video a like. That'd be very, very much appreciated. If you want to see more of this content, hit that subscribe button and become part of the exclusive family. Um, yeah, that's it. So hopefully you have enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching and we'll see you next time.